If you're reaching the breaking point with some of your sleep hygiene habits from scrolling through Instagram late at night or staying up late watching Netflix in bed, then stay with me because in the rest of this video, I'm going to share with you how yin yoga can help you find the deep restorative sleep you crave. Hi, I'm Melissa from Yoga with Melissa. I teach real yoga for real people. Today, I'm a guest here on Alana Kane Yoga. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications so that Alana's fabulous yin yoga classes show up in your subscription feed. Alana's life is so incredibly inspiring, so make sure you stay tuned. Alana and I are collaborating this week, so if you come over to my Yoga Lifestyle channel, you'll see the Alana's video where she talks about yin yoga for sleep too. While you're there, I would love to have you subscribe and press that little bell because I have some great content coming out every Wednesday at 9 a.m. Pacific, including a video for restless leg syndrome and answering a question about whether all yoga is good for anxiety. So today we're talking about getting the deep restorative sleep that your body craves. And I know how easy it is to get stuck in that habit of scrolling through Instagram late at night or watching Netflix in bed. And we know these things affect the quality of our sleep and how well we feel the next day. So when we get a good night's sleep, we experience less anxiety, healthier weight and balanced hormones and better focus. So one of my favorite ways to promote good sleep is to turn to yin yoga. According to traditional Chinese medicine, problems with sleep are associated with the heart meridian. And when the heart meridian organ is deficient, we will experience problems with our sleep. The heart becomes overheated and overactive when yin blood is deficient and you may experience disturbing dreams and an overactive mind leading to those sleep disturbances. When the heart meridian remains peaceful and protected, we can retreat into our interior world to nurture ourselves and after a day of being engaged and active in the exterior world, this creates balance and harmony for our heart meridian and allows us to sleep better. So when you're finished with your work obligations for the day, remember the importance of withdrawing from the yang energy of the world and taking that time to nourish your reserves. This will not only replenish your energy reservoir for the following day, but also lay the foundation for a good night's sleep by eliminating the restlessness that can chase us to bed from the yang energy of the day. Now, one of my favorite yin yoga poses for the heart meridian, which will help to draw you into your interior world and withdraw from the excess of the day is broken wing pose. If you would like my seven best yoga videos for sleep, then go to melissawest.com slash sleep and I'll send that to your inbox. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, then give yourself a thumbs up and put, I am releasing the excess of the day in the comments. Thank you so much, Alana, for having me on the channel and for collaborating. I'm wishing you all the best in your travels. I'm so excited to follow along with you on your adventures, your upcoming adventures. And thanks so much for watching. Namaste.